Hi everyone, welcome to my art class. Today we are going to do a Mother's Day project. Okay, it's a lovely, lovely Mother's Day house. You can see here it says Happy Mother's Day. Ready? Let's do it. Okay, switch camera. Today you will need the color papers. Okay, scissors. And I use tacky glue, it's stronger glue. And the uh, wood stick, I use colorful one. If you don't have a colorful one, that's fine. You can just use the plain wood color, okay? And I use Sharpie to draw so you can see better. And I also have uh, these color squares, okay? And we are going to use this to decorate later. And also the gemstone. You can see there's a lots of beautiful, beautiful uh, shapes in here, okay? And we also need the string. All right, let me put the material on the side, clean the table a little bit, okay? So first one, you can choose any color you like, okay? And I will pick the blue color, okay? And have uh, this color stick ready, ready, okay? This one away. Okay, color stick ready. And you can start to build a house, okay? And by building a house, first we need a triangle, right? Triangle and the square for the bottom. So the shape on the top is triangle, on the bottom is square, okay? That's me start to with the roof. Okay, start with the roof, triangle shape. Okay, and square right here for the bottom part. So you can just, you know, have uh, how many sticks? Let me count. One, two, three, four, five, six. Six stick to build a house. As again, triangle on the top, square on the bottom. Okay, once you're ready, you can have a Sharpie okay and then you can trace your house this is for someone if you don't have a printer okay if you don't have a printer you can just use your hand just use your hand and trace it around the stick and you will get the shape for the house okay like that like that all right so you are after this i think you are ready to cut it out cut out first okay so i'm i have this one i already draw it from the computer so i'm going to use this paper instead of this one okay all right so what i'm going to do i'm going to go ahead and cut it out first okay so follow the line you don't need to cut it too close, okay? A little bit gap, that's fine. Cut out the house. Okay, follow the line and cut. Here we go. Clean, 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 okay? And then next one, I have uh, this one called Tacky Glue. I'm going to start to build a house. So I put Tacky Glue on the roof, triangle part, okay? I will start to do the triangle, okay? Right here. Right here, I got the triangle. You can use any color you like, okay? Triangle ready. And then next one, we are going to do the bottom part. So more tacky glue. More tacky glue. Okay, and glue it on. Glue it on.
and then you've got the pencil you can write happy mother's day okay so let it dry a little bit without touching it and next one i'm going to work in on the door i pick red color okay so the red color again you can use any color you like okay and the red color i'm going to draw a heart a heart for the door and you see the heart shape is like that right so all you need to do is curve curve and make dot on the bottom and connect the connecting it okay so make the dot make a dot one dot two dot okay you can measure it from here you see my finger you can use your finger to measure how big it's going to be so from here to here and then you make the dot from here to here that's how i do it okay and then next one we make two curve okay i want all the students know how to make a heart okay so let's make a curve one and curve two right here a little bit off sorry okay and then you see the dot right here you are going to connect the dot but with you know use curve don't do it straight i have a lot of students use the straight line and the heart look weird okay so curve continue curve, curve and connect to the dots continue curve connect to the dots and you can make a small heart right here again one dot two dot one curve two curve curve to the bottom curve to the bottom you make the door knob already okay all right this one is very easy let's cut it out and i have uh, this one i will already draw and I'm going to just cut it from here. Okay, so you can see, follow the line, closer around the shape, the heart shape, and cut it off. Okay, turn your paper a little bit. A little bit and cut it up. Okay, so I get I have the door right now. And this this one I want the door can be open. Okay, I, I want the door can be open and shut, open and shut. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to just put a little bit tacky glue right here, okay? All right. So just put a little bit tacky glue right here. You can see, and you can use glue stick too, okay? Not necessary tacky glue now. And then all you need to do is put it in the center, okay? And then let it dry, and later on I show you how to do the open you know how to open the door okay all right let it try and next one we are doing a window okay i'm working on the window window it's very easy okay remember remember we said two dots but first you need to see how much space you have okay if you want a bigger then measure it how big you want it and like this one i only want this big all right so you can Put it right here and bring your finger like that and then put two dots like that and put dots okay and then curve curve two curve on the top curve one curve two and please remember curve to connect the dots okay curve connect to the dots curve connect to the dots i have a student so cute you know they do two curve i show you how okay they do two curve and when they connect that they do it straight it become like that you know actually a lot of students doing like this don't do that okay remember curve to the bottom curve to the bottom okay and next one you can do any design for your window i do lines but i want to show you if you want to do different kind of window that's totally fine 
you can come up with your own design okay like window it can be like this it can be you know you can think about it how you want to create windows all right it's up to you or even some of the student fancier wow they decorate the windows okay and then after that they cut it out so it's really you are going you are going to be the designer okay you're going to be the designer and see how you like the window to you know you can working on your window okay just give you an idea all right so put this paper away and i already have this design okay let's cut off on the paper Okay, follow the line. Follow the line. And cut. Here we go. I got a window. And I want my window can be open like this way to this way. So what I'm going to do, I'm just going to put a little bit tacky glue in the center right here just a little bit okay and i'm going to fold this heart in half okay and i put it on glue it on like that and then let it dry okay and then next one i'm ready for the this one string and i want it able to hang it anywhere i like so I have this string and I make a knot before I tape it, all right? But if you don't know how to make the knot, it's okay. Ask for mommy and daddy to help you, okay? And next one, I get a piece of tape, put it over the top, turn it over, tape it on, like that okay so they, later on I will be able to hand it anywhere I like it okay all right next one I'm going to decorate a house okay decorate the house right here with color color papers color square paper and also for the gemstones okay so let me pull this one out I have a lots and lots of beautiful gemstone right there. Okay, so ready? Let's put some decorations, okay? And you know, when I do it, I always come with my students. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, and then like they learn how to count. All right, pick any color you like, okay? And I like to do it like diamond shape right here right here and you pick any color you like any color you like okay this is really fun part you know a lot a lot of uh, students like to do that special you know choosing the color and you know having fun with the color squares okay that's awesome okay all right next one i'm going to do more okay so right here i do one two three one two three you can do the whole thing it's fine okay what whenever you like it any way you like it that will be nice okay okay this one and I want the color right here and you know again this one will be the good practice if you're doing the mosaic Oh, this one I call color mosaic. 
but yeah, uh, it's not really it's paper mosaic. It's not really mosaic mosaic, but you can call it color paper mosaic, square color paper mo mosaic. Okay, and two good practice symmetrical, like you know, for example, teal and then here teal. Okay, and green and green, how to match and teal and teal. Right? Or in other practice is pattern. You can do teal, green, teal, green, teal, green, teal, green, like that. All right. So this is the practice I suggest you. It's very uh, good with the preschooler. Okay. And then it's also fun for the elementary student as well. Okay. All right. Next one, we are going to find a gemstone. Okay. And let's put some tacky glue on the corners. Right here, right here, and one have a one on the top as well. Okay. Here we go. All right, next one, pick the color shape. You like it. Okay, I picked the red one. Oh, this one here has a heart. You can put the heart. Okay, you can put flower. Okay, and you can put this one. Oh no, same color. I want a different color. Here. You can put oval. Okay, you can put a square. Okay, square. And you can put any other shapes. Square flowers, oval, circle. We we can have a circle shape. Okay, let's see if I have a different color here. Green one. Okay. Yellow, red, pink, green. Okay, knows about the colors as well. Okay, and then later, I think this one is close to be done. Okay. Close to be done, and uh, you know, I always tell my students draw. If you like, you can draw. Let me get some color pencil. So you have a uh, this color pencil, and you can open the door now. Okay, open the door. I think it's dry. Okay, you can make a dent right here. Open the door and you can draw anything you like. Anything you like. You can draw your whole family right here. Okay, daddy, mommy, and you. Okay, and you can draw, you know, your pet, dog, or cats on, you know, on the windows. Or you can draw, think about it. What do you like to draw? Okay, flower, anything. You can draw. This is just showing you you have a lot of space and area you can draw. And then also you see the blank space right here, right here. You can just get a pencil do more drawings, okay? So for example, I just uh, think about maybe doing a more decoration for here. So I can draw make this house prettier, fancier, like that, okay. So you know, come out with your own design. Everyone have a different design idea for your lovely, lovely Mother's Day house. And go ahead and do it, okay. Use color pencil. I think color pencil are a really good one for this project. Okay, you can color. Mm, that looks nice. Or you can even make the more flowers. I think I'm going to make flowers right here. Flowers and color in. Okay. And I change color. Like 
uh, and then green. You see, you can just go ahead and design whatever you like to make this house prettier, okay? All right, and then even though here, you can just go ahead and do anything. I'm just showing you a little bit my design. Just showing you a little bit, okay? And come out with your own design, okay? be nice and here's I want it a little bit symmetrical okay and again do it whatever you like to do draw your house and then you know make the nice beautiful modern state project for your for your beautiful beautiful mom okay House is always the best, best, best place to go. Okay, here we go. So, you know, you get the idea how I do it, right? And then you can keep on doing it. Keep on doing it. You can keep on doing it. You still have a lot of space right here. Think about it, what you like to do. And I suggest you to do a whole family right here. Or you can put a family picture here too, okay? And let me show you a different view, okay? This project is done. And let me show you a different view. All right. So this is the Mother's Day. We did it for, to, we do, do it for today. The door can be open window can be open too you see it okay so hope you enjoy the project and then wish every all the mom happy mother's day okay happy happy see you next time bye bye everyone bye bye